Hello parents, welcome back to Kids A to Z. Today I am sharing math sample question paper for class 1 with answers. Here kids need to solve these problems. First question, circle the smallest number. So here the answer is 15. Question number 2, use greater than, less than or equals to sign. So 218 less than 276. For question number 3, kids need to write the after number that is 61. For question number 4, kids need to write the place value and face value of the underlined digit. So here we can see that the underline is in the tens column. So the place value is 8 tens or 80 and Face value is 8 itself. For question number 5, kids need to arrange this number in descending order. So, the answer is 100, 99, 63, then 18. Question number 6, expand 318. So, the answer is 300 plus 1 tenths plus 8 ones. Question number 7. Here kids need to write whether the number is odd or even. Like first one 22 that is an even number. So beside 22 kids need to write even. Then next number is 19. So beside this they need to write odd. Next one 183 that is also odd. So beside this they need to write odd. Question number 8. Here kids need to write the number. We can see in the question the number is 4 tenths plus 7 ones. That is 47. Question number 9. Complete the pattern. 93, 92, 91 is given. So the answer is 90 and then 89. For question B they need to write the number names. Like 121 and 269. Here kids need to do addition. First they need to start with 1's column and then they need to add 10's column. So here 0 plus 0 is equal to 0. So they need to write 0 under 1's column and then under 10's column they need to write 9. So the answer is 90. For question number 2 First, we need to add 1's column and we can see 3 plus 8 equals to 11 that is 1 tenths plus 1 ones. So, they need to write 1 under 1's column and need to carry 1 ten to the tenths column. So, now they need to add 1 plus 6 plus 2 that is 9. So, the answer is 91. Similarly, they need to do these additions for the first one. Answer is 583. And for the second one, we need to apply the same process. That is at first need to add 1's column, then 10's column and at last 100's column. So, answer is 417. Next question is story sum that is story addition. Question is there are 16 apples and 23 mangoes in a basket. How many fruits are there altogether? So to solve this problem kids need to write number of apples equals to 16, number of mangoes equals to 23. Here we need to find how many fruits are there all together? That means we need to do addition. Therefore, total number of fruits equals to 39. And they need to write the answer like 39 fruits are there all together. Soon, I will upload more sample question papers for other subjects. Till then, keep watching Kids A to Z.